Hello everyone, this is the Andrew Doll, aka the German Viking, and I have two articles from Bounding Into Comics, and there, there's one where I'm gonna use the quotes uh, themselves from uh, uh, Warner Brothers and other outlets. So, there are uh, uh, some quotes here. When we learned too that Warner Brothers was releasing a movie called Joker that presents the characters as a protagonist with sympathetic origin story, it gave us pause. We want to be clear with that we support your right for, uh, to free speech and free expression. But as anyone who has... There's always a but. There always has to be a but. But anyone who has ever seen a comic book movie can tell you with great power comes great responsibility. Why are you qu uh, quoting uh, Spider-Man? Uh, a Marvel movie. Uh, that's why we are calling on you to uh, to you use your massive platform and influence influence uh, to join us in our fight to build a safer community with your guns. Over the last few weeks, uh, large American employers from Walmart to CVS have announced that they are going to uh, lean into gun safety. We're calling on you to be part of the growing chorus uh, of corporate leaders who understand that they have social responsibilities to keep us all safe. I imagine uh, trying to get a, a movie to be part of a political movement. How deluded are you? Uh, specifically, we're asking you to do the following uh, and political contribution to candidates who take money from the NRA and vote against guns. Uh, gun reform. These lawmakers are literally putting your customers and employees in danger. Use a political clout in, and leverage in Congress to actively lobby for gun reform. Keeping everyone safe should be a top corpor uh, corporate priority for Warner Brothers. Help fund uh, survivor gun uh, funds and gun violence intervention programs to help survivors of gun violence and to reduce everyday gun violence in the communities. Uh, then we have from TMZ reporting. Uh, uh, th this was basically uh, from the four uh, members of the victims of uh, the ones who, were, uh, who perished in, in Aurora, unfortunately. Uh, but it, it continues with a TMC from uh, Mike uh, Seneca. Uh, he, he says, Katie would have been able to separate the movie from real life. Mike believes those who can't uh, are, are part of the problem. He adds that violent uh, people exist regardless of whether the Joker comes out. And people who have issues with the film soon have to see it. A very good point. Uh, the theater reportedly will not be showing Joker. There are currently no showtimes listed at... Uh, uh, and a theater uh, that employs uh, employee tells the Hollywood Reporter no advanced tickets purchases are available because of the multiplex won't be showing the film. So, the the um, this theater won't be showing this because of some reason. There are also cosplays that aren't uh, allowed into uh, premieres of this uh, movie. Uh, and uh, we, here we have the response. Gun violence uh, in our society is a critical issue and we t extend our deepest sympathy to all victims and families impacted by these tragedies. Our company has a long history uh, of donating to victims of violence, including Aurora. And in recent weeks, our parent company joined uh, other business, uh, business leaders to call on policymakers to enact bipartisan legislation, uh, legislation to address this epidemic. At the same time, Warner Brothers believes that one of the f functions of storytelling is to provoke difficult conversation around complex issues. Make no mistake, neither the fictional character Joker nor the film is an endorsement of real-world violence of any kind. If not the intention of the film, the filmmakers, or the studio to hold uh, this character up as a hero. This is the perfect response to this. Um, and uh, the US Army has sent out uh, a warning to people, so here. Posts on social media have made refer uh, reference uh, to involuntary celibate incel extremists replicating the 2012 theater uh, shooting in Aurora, Colorado at uh, screenings of the Joker movie at national uh, nationwide theaters, even though we know police haven't received any uh, threats or, or, or calls that uh, they should be anyone should be worried. This is just fear mongering if, uh, if you're asking me. This presents uh, a potential risk to DoD personnel and family members, though there are no known, no known specific credible threats to the opening of the Joker on October 4th. See? This is just fear-mongering. 
Incels are an individuals who express frustration per, uh, from perceived uh, disadvantages to starting intimate uh, relationships. Incel extremists idolize violent individuals like the Aurora movie theater shooter. How the how, citation need uh, th that doesn't even make any sense. They also idolize the uh, Joker character, the violent clown from the Batman series. What? Where, when? Wh <sighs> I just can't. That doesn't even make any sense. I'm writing his depiction as a man who must pretend to be happy, but eventually fights back against his bully. This is such a, a red herring of any anyone believing this stuff. The, the, it's just insane people who believe in, uh, I think the Joker is awesome in, in, in his beliefs. He's a good character, but uh, people who believe in, in his ideology are out of their goddamn minds. Uh, when entering theaters, identify to escape groups, remain aware or aware of your surroundings, and remember the f uh, phrase "run, hide, fight." Run if you can. If you are stuck, hide. Also, refer to as uh, sheltering in place and stay quiet. If a shooter finds you, fight whatever you can. <sighs> oh my God! And um, Warner Bros. Uh, tells Access Media to get lost at Joker Red Carpet. So here are the quotes which. <laughs> I mean, you, you're just gonna red pill people uh, uh, when you continue this uh, this road. We didn't make the movie to push buttons. I literally described uh, to Joaquin at uh, one point in those three months as like, look, at, the, uh, at it the, this way, as a way to sneak a real movie in the uh, studio system under the guise of a comic book film. It wasn't. We want to uh, glorify this uh, the, this behavior, it was literally like, let's uh, make a real movie with a real budget and we'll call it effing Joker. That was, uh, that's what it was. I think it was, uh, it's because outrage uh, is a commodity. I think it's something that has been a commodity for a while. What's outstanding to me is, in this discourse, in this movie, is how easily the far left can sound like the far right when it suits their agenda. It's really been an eye-opening for me. Make no mistakes, neither the fictional character Joker nor the film is an endorsement of real-world violence of any kind. It is not the intention of the film, the filmmakers, or the studio to hold this character up as the hero. Thank you. You know, there are so many studies debunking this narrative that movies, games, or entertainment in general uh, are, are the cause of this. Yet time after time, now uh, since the, uh, even the right failed at uh, uh, trying to go after games again, they are going back to uh, to movies. I I I fully support to uh, uh, defend art and uh, its uh, right to exist in any shape or form. It should not be censored, forced to be changed in any way. Let this movie be what it is, and uh, I'll I'll watch uh, movies like Rambo and Joker just because the Pur Puritan or uh, uh, Puritanical authoritarians want to censor and remove this movie from existence uh, just because it, it triggers them and they need their safe space. Anyways, thank you guys for watching, and see you guys next time. Bye.